I'm photographer David Bergman and this is Two Minute Tips for Adorama TV. Something I get asked all the time is, what camera should I buy? Well, of course, there's not one perfect answer to that question since there are so many great cameras on the market. But I'm going to give you some tips to think about next time you go shopping. So what makes a good camera? Well, you can't just look at a spec like megapixels, for example, and assume that more equals better. Just about any modern camera today makes great pictures, but the truth is it's the person behind the lens that makes the images, not the camera. Having said that, if you don't have the camera with you, it's not going to do you any good. My friend Chase Jarvis is credited with the quote, the best camera is the one that's with you, and he's exactly right. The big DSLRs are great, but if it's too big to fit in your bag or purse, you're probably not going to carry it with you. And if it's sitting in your hotel room, you can't take any pictures with it. Know yourself, and if a little point and shoot will fit better in your purse or bag, then that's the one you want to buy. The next thing you have to decide is if you're the type of person who likes to fiddle around with all the settings in the camera or not. If you just want a point and shoot, well, get a point and shoot camera. Done. However, if you want to learn apertures and shutter speeds and change out lenses and do all the things you can do with a fancy camera, get yourself a mirrorless or a DSLR. That way, as your needs grow, you'll be able to upgrade your system. Lastly, if you're using a camera with interchangeable lenses, I recommend you spend more money on lenses than bodies. The camera bodies are little computers, just like your computer at home, and you're probably going to want to replace that every few years. The kit lens that comes with the camera is an excellent start, but once you switch to a fast prime or a zoom lens, you'll never look back. As long as you buy from the same camera manufacturer, you'll be able to use those lenses for a really long time and find that it's a really great investment. So remember, buy a camera that fits your lifestyle and isn't too big to carry around. Decide between a point and shoot and a camera with interchangeable lenses based on how much control you want, and invest in quality lenses and they might literally last you a lifetime. Thanks for joining me today on Adorama TV. Don't forget to subscribe for more amazing videos, follow me on social media at David Bergman, and go to the Adorama Learning Center for lots of other great tips and tricks.